I have a Revel V Plus 5G phone here. I'm going to show you how to wipe or clear the cache partition. By wiping or clearing the cache partition, it can help resolve issues, error message with maybe a camera, your phone could be sluggish or laggy, and that can uh, speed it up as well. Wiping the cache partition doesn't delete any of your personal information. It just deletes temporary files that you don't need anyway, okay? So how do you do this? The first thing is go ahead and turn off your phone. So press and hold the power button. We're going to go ahead and power off. Okay, now once the phone is totally off, the next thing we want to do is we're going to press and hold two buttons simultaneously. It's going to be the volume up and the power. Press and hold both buttons and do not let go until we see the Revel or T-Mobile logo appear. Then we can let go, okay? So do it together. Phone is off, volume up, power. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until we see the logo appear. I'm still holding it. Just vibrate it. There's the logo. Go ahead and let go and give this one second. And we should see a... A dead Android bot and underneath it should say no command as you can see right here okay now what we want to do is this we want to boot up into the uh, Android recovery menu so what we want to do right now is press and hold the power button so I'm holding the power button and the volume up tap once boom here we go okay now the thing is you know uh, a lot of these Android phones typically you have an option that says a uh, white cache uh, partition but this Revel doesn't have it okay so I did some uh, research on the uh, T-Mobile website, and they said in order to wipe the cache partition, what you simply have to do is just go ahead and reboot the system now when you're in the Android recovery menu, okay? So this is the Android uh, recovery options menu. So now you can see that it's automatically highlighted on um, reboot system now. Of course, you can move up or down. You know, you got if you, if you want to factory reset and whatnot, it's down there. But anyway, just go right here reboot system now and then press on the power button right here and it's going to go ahead and just reboot normally and supposedly T-Mobile says that this is uh, wiping the cache partition so there you go so just let it boot up normally and I hope that helped you any questions or issues just comment below good luck